Hello everybody, and this game was going really good, apparently too good, because everyone just rage quit. So towards the end of the gameplay, it gets kind of boring, because there was literally one person left in the lobby, so I was just walking around, taking a trip around Mexico, taking in the sights and stuff. But what I wanted to talk about today, and what kind of triggered my thought pattern was I saw a commercial for the new Purge movie. Now I saw the original Purge movie and I've always kind of found it interesting to think about what would happen if the Purge was real. So for you guys that don't know what the Purge is, you've never heard of the movie, you don't know anything about it. Basically in the Purge they have one day that crime is completely legal. You can kill people, rape people, rob people, you can do whatever you want and it's completely legal. You don't have to worry about getting caught whatsoever. So of course when these kind of movies come out you naturally start thinking about well, what would I do and it's interesting to think about that. So I thought what would be really cool and what I would really like because I don't know maybe it's the psychology person in me. I study psychology it, that's what I'm blaming it on. I thought it would be really interesting to have all of you guys comment in the comment section with what you would do if the purge was real and crime was completely legal you can do whatever you want for that one day now keep in mind there's no cheating on this question you can't move to a place where the purge is not happening you just don't be lame okay don't be lame don't be that guy that's like i'm just gonna leave because why would i stay here you have to answer the question <laughs> would you do anything would you commit a crime would you just hide would you hide in your house would you go somewhere like what would you do i'm interested and really think about it because I want to see some interesting answers in the comments section. So in terms of how I would act in a purge, I've really thought about this. I've thought about it because I find it interesting. And I've thought about, is there any crime that I want to commit? Is there any murders that I want to participate in? And honestly, not really. I just don't have that urge in me to want to go and kill someone <laughs> or go and commit a crime. I think the only crime that I could possibly think about wanting to commit would be like robbing a bank. I wouldn't go and rob a person, that's just mean, but <laughs> robbing a bank, maybe. Maybe I would want to rob a bank, but at the same time, if you're living in a world where the purge happens, the purge exists, banks are going to have the best security ever. Like, you think banks have good security now, banks during the purge are gonna have next level security. Plus, there's gonna be other people that have this bright genius idea of yours to go and rob a bank and you're gonna have to fight with other purge people and you're gonna have to try and get into the bank which is probably gonna be impossible and you'll probably end up just dying most likely. So that just sounds like a whole lot of effort but I mean if you pull it off you get to keep the money because it's legal right? They can't say oh we're gonna take the money off you so if you do succeed you get to keep the money which is good <laughs> but that just sounds like way too much effort and way too much of a risk for me to want to participate in that. The only other thing that I would do that I could maybe see myself doing is being part of some kind of resistance against the purge so we like fight against the purge. That's the only thing that I could think of doing because I I really don't care about committing crimes or killing people. I just I just don't. I'm sorry. So what the most likely thing that I would do I would most likely go and leave my house and go to somewhere where no one's gonna be and just hide. Now I say that I would leave my house and go hide because I don't assume that in this purge universe that I am rich enough to buy super amazing crazy security. So I think it might actually be a lot safer to just go to a place that no one's gonna care about going and just wait for the purge to finish rather than sit in my house. Because people are gonna be looking for houses to rob and kill people so... In my opinion it's better to just go and hide somewhere like go and hide in a bush. I was gonna go sit in a bush for like the entire night and make marshmallows. Except I can't use a fire because then that's giving away my position. Hmm. Okay, never mind. I'm just gonna sit in a bush and just freeze my ass off until the purge is over. I think for me, the whole premise of people just automatically wanting to go and kill people and rob people and do all this stuff when they have the opportunity to is a little too far. What makes more sense to me and what is a lot more intriguing to me is what if for one day you could do whatever you want without being judged for it. I think that is a lot more interesting to me rather than just committing crimes because that covers a wide variety of things. Like you can go and do whatever you want, whatever you're into, whatever turns you on, <laughs> you can do it and no one will judge you, no one can hold it against you, no one can bring it up later and be like, oh you did this, you're a super freak. 
Um, <laughs> yeah, I think that's a lot more intriguing to me because then it's, it's, I think it's more likely that people would take advantage of that rather than killing and robbing people. Because in my opinion, I don't think many normal people actually want to go and do those things. I think that people that do want to do those things would do them anyway. I don't think that it's necessarily going to make people who don't want to do those things do those things during the purge so i would find that a lot more interesting like you can go do drugs if you want you can go sleep around with whoever you want to sleep around with if you like dressing up as a woman and walking around the street in heels you can do that and people will just be like cool good for you because judgment does not exist for that one day and they can't use it against you so i think that that is a lot more intriguing for me but then i sit down and think about that situation too and i'm like what would i do in that situation where i can do whatever i want and not be judged for it and i'm like um <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'm just a really boring person. Yep, that's probably what it is. Honestly, I do what I want anyway. I, I really do. I do exactly what I want. So if there's a day where I can do whatever I want, nothing changes because I don't care if people judge me. And maybe it's because I'm not into super crazy weird things. Like I don't want to dress up as a doll and walk around and have sex with a horse. I don't know so maybe that makes me boring I don't know <laughs> but I would be really 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 interested to know what would you guys do if the purge happened would you participate and also let's expand on the purge let's expand it to being able to do whatever you want in general if you have the opportunity to do whatever you want maybe it's something that you can't really share with people that you feel uncomfortable sharing with people let me know that in the comment section too you can do whatever you want in this universe that I have created what would you do for that day if you could do whatever you want. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a comment. I really want to read through all of them. I'm super just, I'm super interested. I don't know why, but I'm super interested. So I will speak to you awesome people later. Bye.